The Sustainable Built Environment National Research Centre is a unique blend of industry, government and research partners who come together delivering applied research for Australian industry. New Generation Rolling Stock is a 4.4 billion project which will give us 75 new six car sets for Queensland. And the more interesting part is that they'll be fully maintained at a purpose built depot at Wolkaraka in Ipswich, which is now connected to the main line. So in a couple of years time, we'll have a brand new maintenance facility up and running and 75 new six car trains. On the Wolkaraka depot, one of the really interesting innovations that we've used is using BIM. And on that, we had an interactive model so that before we actually dug any holes in the ground, we could tell where the essential services were and make sure that they didn't interfere with any of the other building services. This was a massive step forward in terms of how we've increased productivity by using a technique that made sure we use maximum use of new technology as BIM. BIM and digital engineering as we have it in Langenrook was not a requirement on the project. Um, it is a technology that we as Langerook use as a unique different theatre and a unique offering to our clients. We utilise the technology to manage risk, um, interface risks, design risks, construction risks and everything else. And, and by being able to visualise an environment before construction takes part on, uh, of that piece of work, you can make the informed decisions against that piece of infrastructure or permanent works. To resolve issues um, prior to construction in the, in the model environment, allows us to make informed decisions, to bring the stakeholders along on the journey, and then to make the changes and manage the interface between various bits of structure um, prior to it impacting um, on site. 2D doesn't do that. 2D gives you a good chance to achieve maybe 80% of issue resolution, but that 20% still reflects into standing still on site or unplanned works, and unplanned works are usually where accidents happen because it's, you're doing things that you're not foreseeing. As the project was designed, uh, is, is a collaboration between a number of disciplines. Uh, traditionally, they all go away and do their own designs in 2D. Um, here, they've gone away and done it in 2D, plugged it into the 3D environment, and they've, they've uh, had a, found what the clashes are, what the problems are up front, as opposed to waiting till they're out in the field, trying to resolve them. So from a time perspective, I would say it saved a bit of time, uh, a lot of heartache as well. On this project, I get an updated version of BIM every Tuesday. Uh, we can look at that and review it. Uh, specific element was uh, signal, signal, placement of signals. We were able to sit and go through it with Queensland Rail, have a look where the signal was placed in relation to theirs. We looked at it in the, in the BIM environment and it gave us exactly what we needed to know at that point in time. Yeah.